we have done a lot in in the in this week the very first day obviously we mobilized a lot of resources i felt like that we had to be present and ready to help all of the faculty and all the staff we were all um, obviously traumatized to a point you might not even say traumatized but just in shock and just needed that availability so right off the bat um, on Tuesday I had uh, been able to secure 24 I believe um, outside counselors in addition to our staff um, that were available to meet the needs of the kids and the and the teachers our staff had a meeting um, right off the bat to kind of let them know um, what they knew at that time and to reassure them and then the next morning the uh, they had a statement that they could work with their kiddos and let them know that help is available the counselors are here we had a, a lot of kids come through and just want to talk about their experiences and most of those were very normal and very healthy um, from the Monday incident um, then we kept working with them we have been here all week the entire week um, and we have had counselors from Union, from Broken Arrow, from um, Commerce, from Porter, from Oktaha, from Bixby, um, at Jinx. We've had all of those districts rally b behind us and send their support and for those school counselors and ha have them here in addition to the Creoaks Crisis Management Team and the Oklahoma Critical Incident Network Team. We've had just so much support from trained professionals that unfortunately know how to, um, you know, have been through incidents like this and know how to help kids and faculty. So our faculty has had a, a debriefing that I think was very valuable. We're going to be following up with them by offering a group um, situation through the Grief Center in Tulsa it's going to work with them specifically and offer them that additional support. Um, the kids also, we've identified some kiddos that we're going to follow up with and we've contacted parents and said, you know what, we really want to stay in touch with this kiddo and make sure that he's or she is processing this well. So I think it's been very effective. The kids have um, been great to each other. Um, they've been able to, you know, write and, and do a lot of therapeutic, um, they've used a lot of different therapeutic methods to, to deal with that this week. And, you know, one of the great things I heard just this morning was from one of the teachers that was very close to the incident, um, one of the teachers said, you know, I feel like the kids, for the most part, are kind of, you know, yesterday we had class as normal. And of course, you know, we want to have as much of a normal situation as we can. We're going to be here through Tuesday of next week. And we already have people in place and phone calls that are just a phone call away for our kids. So anytime they need any help, they have a resource of counselors available to them.